A weird night for you in the regard rain delay to start, then a hail delay. Just how does that kind of take you out of your routine, if at all? Yeah, uh, playing in the NL Central back in the day, like I got used to the rain delays. There was a lot of rain in that division. So I looked at the radar uh, before the game and I saw that it looked like it was going to pass soon. So I just kind of stayed on my normal routine and uh, kept walking on the treadmill, kept throwing medicine balls and stuff. Uh, and then during the rain delay, I went out and played catch and threw in the bullpen and actually still felt pretty good, um, felt willing to go back out there. So definitely different than a normal night, but um, I felt like willing and capable to, to do it. Overall, how'd you feel? Uh, fine. Not my best stuff tonight, um, but, you know, that's probably one of those games maybe like last year I, I let it kind of get away, and tonight I was kind of aware early in the game that it probably wasn't my best stuff. Um, we found a way to, to get through it. Curveballs early in counts. We threw the sinker a little bit. Um, we just kind of found a way to get through. Vino said he made one mistake in, in not being clear with Mullins. W what happened in that situation? Yeah. Um, so falling behind against him with a base open, uh, I was I mean, I was thinking about it too in my head. Um, I liked the matchup on deck, uh, especially with what I had working tonight. The matchup on deck probably made more sense. Um, so when we're three and zero, he called up and in, and you know I just didn't get it there. But I was aware of the situation. I just didn't execute. What's it feeling like when you hand the ball over to the bullpen, considering how well they've pitched this season? Yeah, we knew coming into the year that they were going to be a super strength for us. Um, and I mean, they're nasty out there, so it doesn't matter who you're turning it over to. You know they're going to be prepared um, and ready to go. Um, so yeah, I have no problem turning it over to any, any of the 11 guys we have out there. Um, so yeah, I mean, my goal is just keep us in the game, go as deep as possible, and then let those guys do their thing. For a pitcher, what does it mean to you when you give up a home run and the catcher says that's on me? <laughs> yeah, I mean it shows shows me that he's following along really closely with the game. Um, you know, I liked where his head was at on that at least. Um, you know, we didn't execute it the way we wanted, um, but the fact that he was thinking along that in depth, um, you know, I, I really enjoyed working with him tonight. That was our first time working in a game situation. Uh, I think he had caught one of my bullpens, so for him to be like working with me that closely and that in tune. Um, you know, that's that's solid for the pitcher catcher relationship. And it's something like I'm glad we won. I'm glad that didn't change the outcome of the game. Um, and it's a good lesson to learn this this early in the year for us.